Hey you. Looking good. Hey guys, today is the last section of haul videos that I have been doing. This is number three of three. I know. I know. This is an elf haul. So uh, they were doing 40% off if you spent like 50 bucks or something. So I had been wanting to try some things, so I thought that would be the perfect time. The first thing is just kind of boring. It's just their like crease brush. I love crease brushes like this. It's very soft. Haven't used it yet, but I don't, I don't know how much it was. Like three bucks maybe. Very inexpensive. Uh, next, I got one of their matte lip colors in the color T Rose. Like such an Amanda color. And I've never tried any of their matte lip colors, so I'm excited to try this. One of their waterproof eyeliner crayons in the color Moss. Twist up. Really pretty green color. Oh. Oh, this is like dried out. That's unfortunate. I'm not pressing that hard on my eyelids, so I'll probably. We'll be keeping this one. I'll either return it or <laughs> call them and have me send a, uh, send a replacement. But it's a beautiful color. Pressed mineral blushes. I think there are, are four actually. So I picked up all four. And I grabbed number 6321 Cabo Cabana. Um, it ha looks like it has some shimmer in it, but it's not not really that noticeable on the... Well, yeah, it is. You can see it. I don't know if you will... Here, let me do this down here. It's like a light peach color. Number 6322 Sweet Retreat, which is a matte blush. They're very soft. It's just got like more of a pink undertone to it. And then number 6323 Jet Setter. A little bit darker pink. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Right there. And then the last one was 6324 Wanderlust. And this is just a darker, darker rose pink. Prism palettes, I ordered all three of them because they're ten dollars and they're forty percent off, so they're six bucks. I've heard people comparing some of these to the Makeup Geek foiled shadows. I don't own any of those, so I cannot say that, but here, take, it comes with a little sponge, but we're going to take that out. But this is what it looks like. I'm sure you've seen people talking about it. But I wanted to try them, and they are very, like, buttery feeling. I was, I was pretty impressed so far. There's the first three. And then the last three. These are really, like, really great. These are the last three on this side. But, I mean, that's pretty impressive for a drugstore, affordable drugstore. The next palette that I bought was the Sunset one. This is the um, like pink and orange palette. Really beautiful colors. Those look like sunset. Last one. The last one that I bought was the smoke one. This is number eight three three two four, and this is the like jewel tones and grays. I love this green. It looks beautiful. Ooh. Oh yeah. Oh, this one's really good. 
not too shabby, eh? Ooh, that green is beautiful. I love that. So, that was my elf haul. I, um, quite a few things, and I think I spent, like, I think it was, like, $30 or something for everything, which is pretty good, considering the pallets were 10 each normally. So that was my e.l.f. haul. You guys let me know if you've tried any of these products before, if what you think of them. Is there anything from e.l.f. that I'm missing out on that I should try, like, put on a list for future purchase? Um, just let me, let me know. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, and I will talk to you guys soon.